Welcome to another episode of Unturned. Today I joined on a 2 times loot Russia server. The server gives you a small kit and it's always full, meaning that you'll find PvP all the time. I hope you guys will enjoy this video. If you do, make sure to drop a like and subscribe and let's get straight into it. The cool thing about Russia is that everybody starts at the bottom and we would need to make our way up. Now I do have some ideas what I want to do. First of all, I need to build a base. I need to get a crossbow or something from here. And I will build a base very close to here. Oh, crossbow. Oh, chainsaw, perfect. So since I've got a chainsaw this early, I'm actually gonna build the base right now. Even though I don't have anything really important to keep safe. If I do find some loot, I would just come home and depot it. Base is pretty much done. Got myself a 1x2 with two wardrobes. Okay, just killed the guy. Come here, bro. Another one dead. I had a crossbow. He didn't really have anything too good though. Let's see what this first guy that I've killed had. Alright, Schofield, that's mine. That's definitely an upgrade. Now, I heard some famous shots. I think they're happening over at the closest town. So I'm gonna go over there and give it a look. I'm actually going to make a makeshift scope. Okay, well, they did actually spot me. And it's a duo. So I'm, I don't think I'm gonna make it out of this one alive. Okay, hit him. Alright, one's dead. Ouch. Oh, he died. Come here, boy. I hit him. He's freaking out. Hit him again. Okay, he's dead. One's dead. Hit the other dude. Is he really running away from me? He had to go hide. I have no more arrows. Wait, I'm gonna try to go for this guy's loot then really quickly. Come on. Master key, perfect. It's so dark, I really can't see anything as well. Oh, he's pushing me. Okay, got him, got him. Okay, take the phone mask quickly. Oh my god, it's so dark, I literally can't see anything right now. Go away, dude. And there we go, we have successfully made the rack searches from a crossbow to FAMAS, Master Key, and a lot of loot. Now let's see what else we left over here, and then we'll go depot. Alright, that was, that was amazing. Now let's get the hell out of here. Just made myself a couple more wardrobes because I had no more space left. And I'm, I think I actually need to start upgrading the base zone. Because for now, 2x1 is pretty small. I'm thinking of making like a 2x2 two two and then a, a layer of honeycomb all around. That's usually how I do it. And then if I stay on the server for longer, I will just make the second floor. And obviously, the 2x2 two two would probably be full metal with the lockers inside. But first, we still need to get ourselves a blowtorch. Now, I'm gonna head over to Novobirsk. Over there, I'll try to find myself a gas mask. And then we'll just try to hit up the oil rig. It's very close to here and not that much people go there. We actually found a gas mask and a filter right next to each other. Looks like we found an unrated base as well. Partly metal, has some honeycomb. Looks like somebody had the exact same idea as me and that is build a, a stairway towards the dead zone. Now I might do my bed here for now. After finishing the loot run, the first loot run, I will just home, wait a couple of minutes and then jump back down. And then I'll go claim the bed back in my main base. That way I wouldn't really have to climb all the way up every single time. I'm pretty sure I have enough and we do this multiple times until our filter and our gas mask run out. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, after three full runs, I have got myself a bunch of weapons. I've got myself, most importantly, the detonator, a lot of other stuff. We got an elite spec, we got ourselves a bunch of raw a bunch of guns as I've already shown you. So those were really, really good runs. But I ran through the dead zone as quickly as possible. Next, I'm gonna start the honeycomb part of the base. Honeycomb is pretty much done. Now we're just gonna go out there, try to find ourselves some base raid, some PvP. We could technically already start raiding. I think there's somebody in here. It's completely sealed off. Oh yeah, yeah, there is. Somebody just crafted something. Yeah, there is a guy in there. See, he's full gilly with a heartbreaker. Oh. Alright, got them both. Damn, he has full gilly heartbreaker. What does this guy have? I'm gonna go depot these guns at base though. Okay, well it is a duo. We just killed a duo. Let's put these guns in here really quickly. Now we go back. Okay, he's dead. Uh, Viper shots close as well. Okay, he's a back and a drum. That's nice. Right, depoting once again of the items that we got from PvP. How do you come back so quick? They, they have to have a base somewhere close then. Or a body of them is TPing or something like that. Wait, he's up there. Wait, is this their base up here? I saw a base up here. A oh, life base raid? These guys have a wooden shutter. I'm gonna go up there really quickly. We're gonna try to go deep. It might be completely sealed off though. Because it seems like it's just a part of a tower. Air isn't claimed either, so that's pretty good. Alright, come on. Oh. Okay, he's dead. One's dead. 
the hell? Did you really... Destroy the bed. Did you really try to kill me with a saw? Alright, we went deep. He had a viper. Oh, hi, Kel. And an umbrella. Raw. Great. Okay, and some attachments. Right, I'm not sure if these guys are the same that were in the bank. I think it's a different duo. Okay, I could try to get myself a charge from base. I could, I think I could actually craft them already. I'm gonna go depot anyway. Okay, so for now, we don't actually have enough to raid them. So we've decided to leave their base and maybe we'll go back later. We got ourselves a second gas mask, so both of us could actually go to the dead zone now. All right, and the mega zombie is dead. All right, not that bad. We still need ourselves like a metamorphs or an echo, to be honest. Okay, so we're finished from the dead zone. I guess the best thing that we've got was the mega. We got ourselves some high and a bunch of extra guns. We got ourselves an HMG box as well, which is kind of funny. We got ourselves four charges, which for now is not that bad. We're back from a metal run. We got ourselves a bunch of metal. We're gonna use it for lockers and for upgrading the base to metal. We're gonna start upgrading the loot room to metal. Very important if we're gonna get raided. Especially on the server, everybody's running around full geared and everybody has raiding gear in their vault. Gotta be prepared for that. Also got myself some more charges. I used all of the raw that we've got from the previous dead zone run. Now this server has fast salvage too, so it's gonna be very, very useful for when it comes to actually salvaging and upgrading our base. I wish every server honestly has that. So I saw this base a couple of hours ago and we're gonna try to raid this one first. The area's clean, but we could already make the jump onto the pillar. I'm gonna guess that the load is going to be in the metal part because why would they make that part full metal and then leave the rest of the base on wood? So I think that should be enough to break both of them. And we are through. Okay, well, some load. Diving tank. Oh yeah, it's the beds, okay. And one almighty locker. Okay, he's dead. Oh, not that bad. Another Zubak. Bunch of grenades. I'm actually going to use the jackhammer and get a bunch of metal. We really need it in base. For lockers and for base upgrades and for wire for charges. Oh wait, what? There's wardrobes here. This base is fully raided, but there's two wardrobes. Place one there. I think somebody tried to raid it and then they ran out. We need one more charge. Oh my, okay, rocket launcher met some Morris. We got ourselves a maple strike. Raw as well. I did, I did not expect that. We got ourselves a metamorphs finally. And an empty rocket launcher. We probably won't use that rocket launcher unless we find actual rockets. I will not craft rockets because they're more expensive than a charge. But I'm really happy that we got this, the metamorphs. We got ourselves a bunch of ammo at base. Got like two high cal boxes for it. So that's really, really good. These guys that we went deep on actually upgraded their base. Yeah, they're chopping down trees. Look at the tower that they've built. Oh, he's there. Well, they do know about us now then. Should we try to raid them? We still have a couple of charges left. But now they actually replaced the wooden shutters with metal shutters. So it might be a bit harder. Okay, they still didn't claim the area. Oh, he's right back there. Oh, he closed it. I could have just jumped in. Well, I do have two charges left. I'm gonna try to raid. Now, we already know how the base is. They basically, like, just had staircases. So, if we just raid here, we could be able to go down. Oh, oh nice. Oh, it's no longer like that. They made with leathers now. I could maybe try to go back to base and try to craft another charge. I'm not sure if we have enough supplies, but I could give it a go. They have a locker up here as well. Okay, brought the meta. We're gonna try to raid this locker. And it's completely empty. Splendid. I'm gonna use the remaining shots of the meta to break this wall. Okay, we broke that. Oh, he's dead. Um, oh, he's under the thing. Okay, so Nicole got them both and destroyed their beds. Very epic. They were actually much geared than last time as well. Like, they've upgraded the base tremendously with metal everywhere. They made a metal garage for some reason. There's another jackhammer here and there's also a bunch of metal. Eagle fire, they also got the airdrop. Okay, well, the lockers are still here, so I could maybe try to go farm the dead zone really quickly. Get myself, like, two charges and then we'll return. Nicole will stay here, make sure that they don't come back and seal off the base once again. We won't let that happen again. I might have some shots for the metamoras, but I'm pretty Pretty sure it's not going to be enough. Yep, I'm completely out of meta ammo. Time to go to the dead zone then. We'll depot and then we'll go to the dead zone. Okay, I'm in the dead zone. I dig in myself the rod that I've needed. Got myself two charges. Hopefully it's enough. And hopefully they're not empty like that one locker. Okay, perfect already. 
to raw and a sticky grenade. That's already amazing. Now Nicole made a doorway and a door, so if they try to come back, they couldn't really get in unless they salvage. Okay, a timber wolf. I didn't even know spawns on this map. Alright, well, we kind of did profit from that. Two charges, we did get the raw and the sticky in return. Not that bad. Well, alright guys, that's going to be it for episode 1. Now, episode 2 will continue with more base trades and more PvP. I hope that you guys did enjoy. If you did, make sure to drop a like and subscribe. And I will see you in the next one. Bye!